Hello. Hello. All right. All right, Sam. You got to make me the best player in my room. Damn. And I, I'm right now, I'm starting to think that's a tough thing. I looked at your match history. I think you're just playing like all the hard to play, like late game. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying, like, I just don't want to. Honestly, I've been trying to stay away from reroll a lot, but I've started to realize just how bad some of the. Like, I actually think Six Dark Star is almost unplayable. Never it's, play that. Like, I played it. I'm like, what the fuck is this? I, I hit nine Dark Star and lost. And I was like, oh, all right. Yeah. Gen I'm three, nine Dark Star. And there's so much risk involved in it too, and you need like perfect items, and it's just like fuck this shit. Yeah, are you just playing yeah. a lot of reroll right now? I'm play, I play reroll every now and then. I don't play that much. Mm. Uh, I play a uh, hentai sauna a lot. Oh, dude, I want, I, I want to play that comp. It's actually got pretty good, but sometimes, I, sometimes it feels really weird. It's because I think right now I don't know any of the mid game transitions to the to those comps, so you just bleed out a lot of life. Let's try to force it next game, and I'll like help you with the transition. All right. Oh, surfboard. Thanks of for getting you, you have to get tier off carousel. So. The botchinator thinks so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I don't get three tiers by two, two one, we quit, right? Or a two, two four. Yeah. Pretty much. Dude. Uh, also, I watched your last game. There was like a couple uh, breakpoints where I think you could have made like a lot of a lot more gold in the early game, like selling off like the third vanguard. You could hit like. 30 gold after Krugs or whatever. Yeah, I think you like hung on to your vanguards really long. And then uh I think you went like uh I think you went like nine way too fast. You could oh. have, like tank or something. Yeah, I wasn't in, in that situation I, I was pretty sure I was cerebral till I get to I get kill two and then go nine at the very least. You but can, I was like, I, huh. I think you just, was... you still go nine, but you tank one more turn. Oh you, uh for like uh, because I had I I had twenty gold to roll at nine, right? Yeah, but that's not I a mean, lot. That, that's like nothing when you're you know you're buying five cost units or like eight gold upgrade. That's like one MF and an upgrade. And you're like nice, <laughs> like, we made it. <laughs> yeah, that's, you know? true, that's true. That's true. All right, well, there's no way we're not gonna get it, right? Because there's fucking like five. Oh, are you in game by the way? Yeah, yeah. Can you... Oh, this this uh not work. Oh, because it's not sharing. The... You have to share by window, I think. Discord. So, like your uh, game is a different window, I think. Is that Ta -da. it? Yeah, it's working. Perfect. Yeah, I'm fine. You got the tier, nice. Yeah, it's the, the problem is there's three tiers. Yeah, so other people will go it, but I honestly don't. I feel like this build's really strong because unless like three people are contesting, you can play with like two other people playing it or another person playing it. Uh, I've seen I've seen and played all three printer variants. I've even seen someone play the for a fourth printer variant. What's that? Uh, celestial protectors, but that one was terrible. I'm about, pretty sure that one, <laughs> that one was really that. fucking bad. I'll pass on that one. No, 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 the funniest thing he didn't print his Sona. He printed his Sinzao. I played against him. I was like, "What the fuck? Do you do you ever keep this guy. vibe? No, I saw. Okay, okay, that's what I thought. Wait, okay, so what three costumes do you keep? I've kept Jace. That's uh, everything that's... on your bench, and then just buy everything on the bet in the thing. Yeah. But aside uh, like, do you ever keep any three costs at all? Never usually almost never. Because yeah. you can't even get three costs until the round before the carousel. So like that unit just sitting there taking a possible Yeah, the only thing I keep is maybe Jace, and that's it. Yeah, yeah, Jace. I mean Jace is broken, so all right, we need uh, <laughs> we're gonna need three more tiers. This could be some candy land. I'm just saying. Oh, you think so? You see, uh, I I feel like people see one poppy, like damn, dude, this candy land for of sure. Of course, of course. Oh my god. All right, what's the player's scar? I just sell this and double buy, right? Yeah. But yeah, I'm just yeah. waiting. Fucking candy land, dude. <laughs> You should buy the Jarvan too. Oh, well, how do I? I mean, if you get the money. Yeah, 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 okay. Is this just to open ourselves up for Zaya, or is it just because the unit's good? I just always leave myself like really open and slice everything. Wait, we just hit three pairs. And a double. 
Oh, yeah. You should just play Mana Printer Candyland. I mean, this is like free win right now. Uh, okay, you just win the game pretty much. <laughs> what the fuck? Right, I'm gonna fuck? go take a dump, Scar. Good luck. I'm just kidding. <laughs> what the fuck? Nice coaching session. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> wait, I actually don't know how to, how, to, how to play into it. Is it just like you roll at. I've seen people roll all the way down at 3 1, or and I've seen people roll and say at 50 gold at 5. Or. A level five. I think you should always roll in three one if you're if you if you're close. Like you have four poppies, right? So you should always, you know what yeah. I mean. Wait, so uh, uh, this is just a mana printer version of of Candyland, fucking yeah. Willy Wonka. Oh yeah, man. you played that. I played it once. It I was think pretty, it's pretty good. good. Yeah, it was really good. good actually when I played it. I think it's worse than the other versions, but you stabilize so early, you have like five hundred health. You have like 50 more health than the other version to start with. I think... Yeah, I think both versions are good. I think the Brawler version is the best. But I mean, you're just... You're so high. <laughs> Calm down, okay? What do you mean? You get the kill before Krug's last game? Yeah, I, I saw that I was like, oh, this is a fucking top three. It's <laughs> top yeah. four, four right. easy. So oh, usually, wait. um... I almost uh, always slam items early, by the way. Uh, but in this case, like, since you're gonna force... Uh, you know, printer or whatever, you should well, just like. Hold I would on just to do it. this, right? And just put like a not... tier on Caitlyn or something. Uh, this Caitlyn gets Caitlyn gets sold in your comp, right? Yeah, she gets sold. Do you okay? I actually don't know the exact way. What are the five units you want on the Willy Wonka version? It's just Sona and like Poppy, and you hold like one Leona till you get Wukong, right? Uh, yep, pretty fine. And then you you, you, you three star TF and Zoe. We got uh, TF, Zoe, and Poppy. Do you three star Ari? I've seen people do that a lot. You can use Ari, or you can use Syndra, or you can use Velkas or Lux. Like you pretty much play anything. Like sometimes I'll just like run GP like later or MF. Wait, what the fuck? Yeah, you go like six orc with like just a random legendary. Alright, you want to try to get Econ here, so you should sell Grave. One, two, three. should try to get to 10 gold. In this situation though, do I ever sell... I'd sell Caitlyn too. You sell Caitlyn? Yep. You could keep it too, but it's like... It's so risky. Well, no, like, Carousel Fire is really important to me here. And then after this, you like, you start with... Uh, because uh, you... You really want the- you go for the first chalice, right? Yeah. Okay. Cause like, when I run printer, it was always get two tiers, then two chalices, then the last seraphs. Yeah. Yeah, you can go like seraphs later. It's like unplayable without the chalices anyways. Well, I mean, you can play Candyland without having the printer. Yeah, well, you, yeah, yeah. You could have done it in the reverse where it's like, let's say you don't hit the printer items, you can just keep the seraphs on like a TF or something. Mm. You could probably have played to like win streak with this, you know? Yeah, yeah, because that was an option, right? If I just serve yeah. something. Yeah. And now you get three gold. Uh, and now I get four negatrons. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's like good job hinting for that. <laughs> Wait, I would have hit one of these anyways. Nah, that's great. It's great. You get huh. the three gold one. Come on. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's true. The three gold, and now we go mech, right? Yeah. That's how the pivot works. Yeah, I hate did, mech. Did Did you watch Kiyu play? Yeah, but I don't know. I'm not sold on it. Look, he had the luckiest mech game I've seen in my life. Like, he hit first place. Okay, it, this is two five. This is the PB round right here, okay? He gets three Annies in one box. It auto combines on his bench. Okay, and he also gets Shaco Rumble that round two off the uh, off another box or something. And then he hits Fizz the next round. <laughs> this is a star game. Wait, what, what, what the fuck do I do here? Uh, just... you can just put, you can just make a Ari your printer and then rebuild her. Like, start, put all your items in Ari. So like this? Yep. But then would you ever buy the second Ari? I would sell Leona to buy an Ari. Oh, this guy doesn't say anything. Um, hmm. It's okay, friend. Look how many, <laughs> look how many poppies you have. Same. This guy's looking awfully similar to me. It's okay, we get to see the Skara APM. 
Just oh, no, have no, faster no, no. fingers than him, okay? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I thought you said to be lucky. So how old are you again, Scar? No, like, like 50? 50? Okay. Crack your knuckles, man. Take your arthritis medicine first. Wait, do I win this? Holy shit. Wait. <laughs> Oh my god, you're so high, bro. So, in this situation, the TF is like not very high chance of happening. Um, which is not the end of the world. Uh, I think a big mistake a lot of people make when they do this stuff is they have it in their mind of like, I have to have like these three units, three start, or else I can't play the game, right? Right. But like, if you don't hit the TF, that just means that you can push levels to go for like a different carry, like Belkaz or something. Because he'll basically do the same amount of damage as TF would. Right. It's just TF is the easy way out. Because yeah. if you hit it, it's just... <laughs> but you have one TF and... Yeah, yeah, it's unlikely. Uh, I'm rebuilding this Ari. Hmm. You won't do that till like, way later, though. Really? Like, you won't do that till like, level 6 or 7 or something. Probably, like, 6. Unless you just, like, randomly hit, like, a Sona, too. Because, like, let's say you get Sona uh, at level 5. You're not, like, who are you printing mana for, you know? Like, you're not, you're not really giving a certain person damage, though. So you're just keeping Ari in and keeping Sol on your bench? Yeah. Chaos is the preferred state of nature. <sighs> oh, wow, I have six pop. Okay, so the most important unit in this comp is just Poppy, right? Everything else is like whatever. Poppy and Sona? Yeah. Uh, Three star do Sona I... doesn't matter that much, but it's nice. You do probably I... won't be able to get it this game, though. Do I? Fair. After getting Ari 2, I just don't buy Ari's, right? Doesn't fucking matter. Uh, you can buy more Ari's if you want. Like, if I rebuild her, I'll just put another one in, or... Like, I might replace her later with a different mage, or, like, Syndra. I don't oh, really like... think, like, she matters that much. Okay. Oh, oh wow. my <laughs> god. Yeah, just make sure you get all the tears. Perfect item. <laughs> just do that. Yeah, yeah, you Not know, you know, no problem. Uh, do we care about Sona. Okay. Wait. I fucked up already. So what do you do from here? Uh, do you do go I to twenty? Going? Go to twenty and stop. Huh. That's fine. Like the I don't reason the reason I say don't roll down here is cause Zoe doesn't carry games. And you can probably get her later anyways, and you're never gonna 3 start TF, right? Right. So it's oh. like, kind of what we talked about where you want to just play for the next carry, and the next carry is probably like Velkaz. Yeah, the most important hit was just Poppy? Yep. So you can start itemizing Poppy. I mean, you, you know all the items. Uh, but we're finishing Printer first, right? Uh, yeah. But I mean, I wouldn't tunnel it too hard. Uh, just because yeah. you don't have the Sony yet, you know? Yeah, yeah. So we just go Bramble into Declaw Deathcap? Yeah, I think the Declaw is actually more important than Bramble. Really? Well, you have two Vanguards, so... Oh, it's super dense! Wait, I didn't even fucking realize! Uh, yeah, that's why you took so much damage. Uh, actually, th this build is OP on super dense because you can get six orcs in so easy. Oh... Yeah, and you would have had the Sona like, printing the mana already. Is, it, is this good? That's fine. So you kind of want your position, I mean, I guess since she's your mana printer, but you kind of want everything like boxed up in the corner. You want it like clumped up. Um, so like you, I'll explain it like after this. You kind of want so, to move all your units over to like the left or the right side. And then you want your TF to be like right below your tank line. So you can get like better angles in this. Oh, so it's like the way you play the printer version? This is squid version? Oh, yeah. the squid version, yeah. Yeah, TF's just like a, a janky squid that sometimes ints or whatever. The sometimes ends? Yeah. Huh. Alright, alright. So, so, from here, where do you think we place? I mean, look at, look at the other guy first. The TF should be up one square, by the way. I think you're fine. You can place first. So, TF goes, like, to the left of Ari. And, and then, you do this? Zoe, bottom left. So, the, yep. the mana thing is two squares. So, you can actually spread out, like, a decent amount. And you put like Zoe bottom left all the way. Okay. And so this blitz positioning is actually gonna make you in because think oh, about 
The Ari will like orb is weird. Yeah, she'll always ultimate left, so just keep that in mind. Fuck. How do you feel about this as opposed to the the, sh the fucking Zaya reroll? I think they're both good. It's like I just whatever item I get at the beginning, I just slam it, and then I just build a comp off. I think slamming mm -hmm. items is like the most important thing. Yeah, because I feel like it's impossible to lose streak right now. You're gonna get rolled. Yeah, if you lose streak, you just like I actually don't like super dense is my least favorite galaxy just because if you low you roll, fucked. yeah, you'll be like dead by wolves. You're just like wait a sec. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So you actually need poppy items now. You kind of got unlucky that usually, like, you don't finish your your print. Yeah. This, this early, usually, you so finish printer at like stage four four PV round. You're yeah. praying for like the last item. So I don't know. This is kind of a weird game. Yeah, especially because I don't have a Sona. I fucking rolled over it. Uh... So yeah, probably um, after wolves, you roll to like. You can get the Vel you can just put Velkaz in and like say fuck the Chrono probably. Since you already have printer, right? you can run four sorks, you know. Okay. All right, and I pray to fucking God. So it's gonna be a Velkaz carry from this position. Yeah. So you just put all basically you just put all your AP items on Velkaz. Same way you would play Squid. You just give him like Death Cap, just like and then like QSS or like straight AP. He doesn't uh, need like QSS for sure because Sona will cleanse the stun off of him. Okay. This guy has zero gold, so he's griefing. Like this I look is... at his items, I feel like he has really good items. It's just like I hit like some nutty stuff. Yeah. But see, this is like what I was kind of talking about. The big mistake people make with the build is like he thinks he has to have these units upgraded to win the game, you know. But I mean, he did kind of lower all the poppy, so he's gonna lose the game anyway. But it's just like that mindset of like ruining all your econ and then making it to where you can never recover. Because you yeah. could have slow rolled it if you wanted to. Yeah, man, I, I definitely made that mistake a lot with reroll comps. And if you have no econ, you just lose, right? Pretty much. It's like no recovery? Yeah, you just like auto loot. Wait, so so we just replaced with the Wukong, right? And we yeah, play these four? Yep, yeah, and then after that, you'll just. Go two levels up and then put in six orcs. And then you can run like Lulu or whatever. Or like put like a, just any legendary unit in there with it. Uh, is it? But then we can't go Sona, right? You go Sona. You're gonna get rid of Ari. Oh, yeah. yeah. But then where do I get six orcs at seven? Oh, I mean, it's just. I'm talking about as you push levels. I'm just. Ah. I'm not talking about exact levels. But... Oh, yeah. I think this is actually one of the luckiest games I've had, like, ever. Is it? I mean, you have, like, level 1, yeah, it's not that. I mean, the items, yeah, the items are nasty, but... Like, wait, I rolled six poppies? Like... Let's see, imagine this world, that you just keep getting tears and you never get tank items on your poppy. And then you're just like, fuck. Ah. That could happen, man. What did, the, like, three tears drop here? Then we lose? Just FF? Yeah. And I just raw push levels now, right? Uh, yeah, I would. Well, it's, three, it's like I said, three starring Sona doesn't matter that much. And I already saw two people holding Sona, so it's like... It's like impossible, right? Yeah. Wait, is this guy going... That guy's going to take Velikaz too. So that's another reason you need to push levels, so you can actually get a two -star. Do you You're... like that that way of playing of the what you call the the squid with Kazix? Yeah, where you reroll for Kazix and go up. I feel like that one's really. Uh, weird. I never reroll for Kazix. I'll play that build if it's like uh, Galaxy where you get free the free units. Uh, mm. What is it? The Star Cluster. You're seeing three. Or are you doing reroll Galaxy? You should just make like. Uh, like a ZZ Rod or something, or... Just oh, Morello, yeah, Morello's good. And then, what the fuck do I do with these items? <laughs> you can just wait, I think. That can be, like, uh, armor items for pop. Oh, yeah, it could be Titans. Uh, I... Is a Fawn useful in this comp at all? Oh, uh, is it, like, an item? Yeah. Or, no, like, just a, a spat. Wow, we got... Oh, I mean, you can get another Fawn. You can make, like, Star Guardian on 
uh, Velikaz or something. Oh, yeah. It's, just, yeah. it's like random stuff you can do. Or you can go, uh, like Celestial or something later. Or like Demo, and then like the GPN. <laughs> Pretty much you should just like push fast seven. And then like, uh, try to roll for your Velkaz. Okay, and then we go, okay, Sorks, Velkaz. Wukong, got it. Just roll to like get something to where you can transfer the RE item. Hmm. Dude, does, you always run three star guardians, right? So I just want to pick up Syndra and Ari and just two or three star one of the other ones, right? Well, you're probably going to drop Ari for Syndra. Yeah. yeah okay. Just because, like, you're more likely to upgrade her at this point in the game. But I think this is, like, a big mistake people make, too, is, like, they tunnel on uh, that they have to have a certain unit and they kind of, like, skip out on, like, transitions. So, like, the stuff like making Ari your transition in, in like this comp, because this works in the, the Velkaz version too with the the brawlers, is you just use Ari and TF until you find Velkaz and it just like carries your mid game. Mm. You level here, right? Yeah. Just. Yeah. You can actually transfer items over now. Here? Yeah. It's fine. On level one, I'm I'm worried, man. I mean, just yeah, put her down like one, cause it's too too range. Right? Yeah, yeah. Good luck, Sana. Good luck. <laughs> what if I just get randomly one shot here? Yeah, you're good, man. He won't. That's all, guys. Too. Wait. So you should probably roll a little bit on seven to. Get, you know your two cost two star Sona. And... Wait, this guy has Cho two Kazix three Velkaz two. Yeah, but his item sucks, so he's gonna die. Ah. Uh, he so doesn't have the Scara luck. Okay. It's yeah, true yeah, it's true, true, true. He's missing that most important piece. We got Mord on speed now. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh what okay. What do you think's good here? Uh, Zephyr? The yeah, fuck? Zephyr's fine. Our Maybe Celestial. Dark Star. Zephyr or Celestial. Dark Dark Star is pretty much useless, I think. Okay, okay. This is a terrible. This is a. Uh... Sure. You can just put it on Poppy. You can just tank stats. Yep. Magic resist hell. Yeah, but what if I get a Thief's glove here? Put it on your carry. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so you just want me to call fifty gold and roll here? Uh, yeah, you just chill, like, just slow roll it. I will defend the stars. There's no way we ever go to the six star guardian version, yeah. right? Maybe if you get like a tier and get the item. I think six star guardian is overkill. You can okay. keep rolling. So you can actually just push levels now, I think. For six sorcerers. Yeah. And then you'll just sit on eight and roll until you have everything to start. Because that guy might just die. You know, the other Velkaz. Yeah, yeah, he's probably going to. But the other player is actually above us. He, he's running the four star, four star Guardians. He don't look that mm. strong. Goodbye, Sona. <laughs> Wait, well, we think we don't look that strong. But she fought the good fight, okay? Do I win this or do I lose this? Close. So from this position, you just want me to push eight for six yeah. orcs. Usually when gold's on fifty-seven, I mean maybe this just a habit of me, but I always roll one time on fifty-seven. For some reason that interval just like feels like it just feels good to roll on that. I don't know why. Oh, uh, you're fi so fifty-seven roll one. Oh, this yeah, the I'll same tactic. I always roll once. It's because it's like I could hit a power spike without investing much, and then I put one point in XP. Okay, the know, fifty-seven, that's... dude. That just caused me to spike so hard. You're nuts. You're that's you're fucking the fit. Okay. <laughs> My chat's fucking writing this down. They're like, well, okay, okay. It's a fifty-seven. Gold. I don't know why that gold just feels good. It always feels good. Uh, this guy's trying to kill my poppy. I don't think he's broken the shield. Okay, it's got that Zephyr power spike. <laughs> he doesn't have last whisper, he's trying. <laughs> Wait. 
I think that guy ran the same comp last game too. Oh yeah, the comp. Oh, that's, that's kind of nasty. Sure. Do you do you so give up on uh, TF here? I keep him. I just, I mean, if it doesn't hurt me, I just keep it. Okay. So I just yeah, you push eight, and well, how low, low health is the other guy? So you just keeping I, I like I'm always this... like. If somebody's contesting me, I'm always marking them and like just. Right, right. He's at 36, them. and the other guy's at 23. This guy's got fucking crazy units, but. Yeah, he has no mana. Though. Oh, he has no print. He has such bad items for Velcros. Yeah. He's probably. What the fuck? Uh. <laughs> damn. Okay. I mean, that could be Celestia. I'd probably just on, on leveling right. first. Level. You just push eight right here, yeah, right? Yeah, put the six work. And there's Annie right there. And I put Annie, oh. and this wouldn't do anything. And oh. then you can just make like another Zephyr on Wukong. Would you just give up on Ari here? Instead of so, or do you not care about having four Star Guardians? I don't really care. You can make another Zephyr. Put like the random chain cast items or stuff. So. What the fuck are these? Uh, do you, do you want RFC? Do I want RFC or Giant Slayer? Uh, oh, take your pick. Man. What the? F huh? Cinder go go. I I guess I'm gonna RFC my TF. There you go. Wait, so here, I, I would actually just push to 9. So this is like another thing I was talking about is like, don't tunnel on one unit being a power spike. Like, have it formed in your head where it's like, is that 2-star unit going to do more damage than those two 1-star units combined? Or like, mm -hmm. is a 2-star Velkaz going to have more impact than a 1-star Lulu and a 1-star Velkaz? So uh, I feel like we're not bleeding, so you just want me to put in Lulu here, right? Yep, you can do that. And that gives you Mystic. And it, are they in assassins or anything like that in the lobby? It, it does really well. But if you don't the, have a Lulu, then you just play like a damage source. Right. Play. Do I just double sell the TFs here? Pre yeah, you do that. You do that. Or single sell, I guess, because I'm I feel so fucking strong. What? And yeah, mana printer's broken. Yeah, I'm starting to realize that. It, it's literally just prints for LP. It also helps if you get like 16 tiers before Krugs, but... Yeah, 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 I mean, obviously, like, there was a bit of high rolling involved in this game. No, skill, it was skill stuff. Yeah, yeah, skill rolling, yeah, you yeah. Summoned them. <laughs> you summoned five tiers before fucking stage three? Yeah, better player. So, you can replace Ari with uh, Zareth when you get her, and then that gives you the three star guardians. Ah. How good is Zareth in this comp? Is he still good without any it's items? It's a five cost unit. Uh, I, mean, <laughs> I mean, dude, Echo's a five cost unit. I don't play without Cyber. Yeah, I mean, there's like a three Cyber. Oh wait, uh, wait, but we could, oh. right? We could have been two, two infiltrators. Oh yep, yep, there it is. Oh, I could have infiltrated and played. We could have added an Echo. Wait, that was the tech. Wait, I fucked up. I know. You can still I get like uh, Spat later on game. Got oh, that yeah, Spat pop off. So, um, I feel like this is just a podcast now. It's not like, oh, yeah. the fuck? So, uh, you watching any shows or? Yeah. <laughs> That's how I feel. What the fuck? Keeping up on Tower of God. You watch that? Yeah, I, I've, okay. I've only watched two episodes and I got really sucked into Valorant, but it's good. Like, I, after, I thought the second episode was a lot better than the first. Yeah, I'm feeling it. All right, what item are we getting here? Dude, I don't fucking know. I got blade. Are you sure it's not blade? I have two blade. I have a blade. <laughs> it's gonna be, be a spat of Zareth. And then... You can save the YouTubers for later, Scar. Okay, come on. Just gonna play Velkaz, I guess. Yeah, that Velkaz. works. Is our friend about to. Is he dead? Oh, he's dead. Yep, That's he's fine. one of so... the guys dead, and this guy's the other guy. He put G on Sona. Huh. That's top. Okay, well, he's done. Pretty much, uh, yeah, now you just go 9 after PV and then just win the game. I think I need to switch sides. I'm gonna get owned by this Rakan. Ah, ooh. Whoops. 
This guy actually looks pretty strong. Yeah, but it, he has no QSS, so if his side gets randomly hit oh. like that, then he just loses. And he has no Last Whisperer. Yeah, his items are grief. Wait, he That's went from unlucky. he went from second place to fourth. I mean, he's trolling with his items. I don't know what to tell you, man. Wait, I, I always stopped playing this comp. I needed um, what should we call it? Good poppy items, but I guess nah, it doesn't matter. <laughs> you, two, you don't have two Vanguard, man. That's all you need. That's 165 armor. That's why I said the only item that really matters is Dragon Claw if it's a really AP heavy buff. Otherwise, mm. it, or, or if there's like uh, like Space Jam or some shit that's super high roll. Right. What do you, What do you think about protectors right now? I think the only playable protector build is Shredder. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, uh... Huh. I mean, I haven't tried out that much stuff, but... Yay, what's up? Wow, Scar, you're so good. Wait, wait, wait. Hold, hold up. I'm actually talking with... So... I need... Probably not right now. Okay. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Right, there's your Sandra. Oh, and a Luden, so wow. Yeah. Don't, don't, wait, don't. wait, sorry, sorry, someone just came in. What's up? Oh, uh, I was saying, I don't know. You win. Congratulations. What the fuck? <laughs> so there is nothing I need to do this game. I, I, I mean, this game pretty much just played itself for you, but... I, it's mainly, like, the things that... So, like, I was just kind of fucking around, like, playing Valorant. I was like stuck. I was just like playing like 100, 200 LP because I didn't like the patch. And then so I got like kind of sweaty on this patch. And the, and the biggest thing that like made me like climb Milo is just slamming items super early and just like going ham on your comp early. Mm. You just like build your comp off like whatever you slam. You just level here for this, right? Yeah, you level and just roll down. And the game's over. Well, what if they power spike and I die here? Just go next. <laughs> just just go next? Yeah. Let them try to stop just go next. I'm holding so many fucking units. Wait, I didn't even use my items. <laughs> Put this bat on somebody to intimidate. Uh... There you go. <laughs> Perfect item poppy. <laughs> this is all I needed to win the game? Just says this... Oh my... Yeah, you don't even have two star Velikaz and you've been winning this whole time. Huh. You get baby Wukong. Huh. <laughs> Holy shit. I'm not even gonna switch sides. I'm really curious to see if he can kill me. All right, let's see it. I. He has six celestial. He maybe what he can out heal my damage. Morello and you one shot. Yeah, him. maybe he can out heal my damage. We'll see. We'll see. Can you kill more. level one Wukong? <laughs> no. <laughs> it's like what? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. So the main takeaways is. Just knowing your transition pieces. I mean, mm -hmm. you already hit it in the game before. You had like Zaya. This you can see like how Ari yeah, is like I, usually the main transition piece in like these printer comps. Like you I just thought, use her as like whatever. I thought TF was super important for this comp, but actually it's whatever. Um, I mean, it, it's like it's there if you get it. It's like nice. yeah. It's, it's just I, it's, like think about who your carry is gonna be in like how yeah, close you are. The Ari transition piece helped out a lot. Yeah. All right, Skara. Good luck. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Enjoy your LP. <laughs> and before I fall to diamond after this one. <laughs>